Mr. Speaker, I've previously spoken in this House about the need to address the pressing issue of violence against women. Today I'm raising the particular issue of violence against immigrant women. Systemic issues of gender inequality mean that immigrant women are frequently forced to relinquish their status in Canada in order to es escape domestically abusive relationships or abusive employers. These particular victims of violence are often slipping through the cracks of our immigration system because they're ineligible for refugee status or for consideration as humanitarian and, consider or, and compassionate grounds. Women in this situation rarely see their abusers brought to justice because they're removed from Canada before their cases can be resolved. So as we prepare to debate the motion brought by my colleague from Churchill to establish a coordinated national action plan to address violence against women, I call upon the government to examine the precarious situation of immigrant women who are victims of violence and often have no recourse due to the loss of their immigration status. The Honourable Member for Scarborough Centre.